Order. Question 15 closed. Question, Mr. Graham Allen. Number 15, Mr. Speaker. The Prime Minister. Uh, we should be proud that in the Magna Carta, our country established rules of justice and freedom, which 800 years later still inform our constitution and resonate around the world. While there is a long-standing debate over the issue, there are no plans at present for a written constitution. Mr Graham Allen. Mr President, so I note that from the Prime Minister. Would he agree, though, that there are unacceptably high levels of voter disengagement, with more people staying at home than voted Labour and Conservative at the last election? Would he commit his government now to prepare an all-party uh, convention, constitutional convention, to give every UK citizen a copy of our society's rulebook, either a statute of the Union or a written constitution, as a part of electors feeling once again that they own our democracy. Prime Minister. I, obviously, I always look at the right hon. Gentleman's suggestions very carefully because he's made a number of sensible cross-party interventions over recent years, but I have my doubts whether another um, talking convention is the answer. I think we need to look at some of the constitutional issues that leave people feeling left behind, not least English votes for English laws, and make sure we put them in place. And the disappointment I have with the Labour Party is they are prepared to talk about all party talks on Wales or on Scotland or on Northern Ireland, but when it comes to empowering English people and making sure they have rights in this House, they're completely absent from the debate.